Hey guys, AppShrink.com here, and today I'm going to be diving in to show you how to make a very simple automator app that will change your time machine interval um, simply by selecting it from a list such as this one. So we're going to go and select 24 hours, type in our password, and the backup interval for your time machine will instantly be changed. Now, this is very convenient because Apple doesn't actually allow you to do this anywhere in settings. So having something like this is very useful. Let's go ahead and take a look at the code that does this. You could do this in Automator or you could do this in Apple Script. I'm simply using a run Apple Script command in Automator um, because it's just easier to do for me. You could alternatively do this with a terminal command. Here it is. I will make this available in the description below. Or you could just download this app that I have made from the description below as well. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the code. Basically first what you're gonna do is prompt uh, the user to select the different hours and we're gonna set this to a variable called hours. And you could alternatively uh, name your buttons as you wish. If you don't have this, it will just have a button called OK and a button called cancel. But I've set the OK button to say go and the cancel button is cancel still. So. Uh, next, in order to prevent crashing the app, we have this if statement, which basically returns a user canceled if you uh, click the cancel button. Next, we're going to take uh, the hours, which is 1, 2, 3, 6, 12, and 4, and multiply them by uh, 3600, which is basically the number of seconds in an hour. This will give us an interval in seconds because Time Machine operates in seconds. As you can see from this pseudo command that you would type into terminal, uh, you set the interval in seconds. So 7200 seconds is two hours. Next, we're going to execute a shell script in our Apple script, um, which is basically the exact same command without the sudo, however. Uh, this will come in later, where you type in with administrator privileges, and that's when it prompts you for the password. Now, uh, this variable that changes depending on how many hours you choose, the 7200, uh, is actually represented by interval. So how you would do that is, this is essentially a string, you would give it a space between here and uh, the little curly things, and type in interval with administrator privileges. And then we simply display a dialog box with, which tells you that your time machine backup will now occur every this many hours, which is a variable that you will substitute into the string. Pretty straightforward code, very easy to do. You could simply copy it from the description below, or you could alternatively download the app that I will make available as well. Hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial. I have uh, several hour options down here in seconds, so you can conveniently adjust it as you wish. And I hope this has helped you a lot. Thanks again for watching and I will see you in the next video.